We will discover all the scientific information on gastroesophageal reflux disease, commonly called GERD, in this video. When you eat, food travels via the esophagus from the throat to the stomach. Food that has been swallowed is prevented from ascending by a ring of muscular fibers in the lower esophagus. The lower esophageal sphincter is the name given to these muscle fibers. Stomach contents may flow back into the esophagus if this muscle ring does not completely seal. This condition is referred to as gastroesophageal reflux disease, or GERD. Heartburn and regurgitation are two indications of harsh stomach acids. Additionally, it can harm the lining of the esophagus. Smoking, alcohol abuse, obesity, pregnancy, scleroderma, and hiatal hernia are risk factors for reflux. Certain medications, such as bronchodilators, analgesics, beta blockers, calcium channel blockers, and sedatives, might also contribute to gastroesophageal reflux symptoms. Heartburn, a pain in the middle of the chest referred to back dysphagia, a sore throat, coughing, increased salivation, and shortness of breath, are all symptoms of reflux. Following a thorough physical examination during which you discuss your symptoms and medical background, reflux is first diagnosed. Your doctor might start treating you if you have heartburn and regurgitation, which are common signs of reflux illness, without doing any specific diagnostic procedures. However, if your symptoms are unusual, severe, or unresponsive to first therapy, testing might be carried out. Upper endoscopy, which enables your doctor to inspect the lining of your esophagus, stomach, and first section of your small intestine, is the most diagnostic procedure for reflux disease. Esophagitis, esophageal stricture, and Barrett's esophagus are the most typical consequences of reflux. The cells lining the esophagus can transform into cells resembling the lining of the gut in Barrett's esophagus. It may progress to esophageal cancer. Changes in lifestyle are crucial for preventing GERD. This includes consuming frequent, short meals rather than large ones, remaining upright after eating, finishing meals two to three hours before bedtime, abstaining from drunkenness and smoking, losing weight if overweight, and avoiding wearing tight clothing around the abdomen. Foods may trigger reflux symptoms include spicy food, chocolates, peppermint, coffee, alcoholic drinks, and foods containing tomato products. What about reflux treatment? Medical treatment of gastroesophageal reflux disease is comprised of antacids anti-secretory agents, like H2 receptor antagonists or proton pump inhibitors, and prokinetics that help the stomach empty faster. Surgery could be advised if reflux symptoms do not dramatically improve after making lifestyle and medication adjustments. The most common surgical procedure for treatment of reflux disease is a fundoplication operation in which the surgeon sews the top of the stomach around the esophagus. This adds pressure to the lower end of the esophagus and is generally successful at reducing acid reflux. In the end, if you liked this video, do not forget to subscribe to the channel and activate the bell button to receive all new updates. Goodbye!